Hi, this is Steve, and in this video, I'm going to give you a quick update on Bing. Bing has just introduced the concept of expanded ads, and their expanded ad setup is slightly different from what was shown in the previous video. So let me go ahead and show you how to set up an expanded ad with ClickMagic. So the first thing you want to do is you want to log into your Bing account. You want to go to your campaign that you've already set up. You want to go up to the Ads tab right here. And here I have the standard ad that I showed in the previous video. Here is the expanded version. So let me go ahead and edit the expanded version. It's very, very similar to the other one. Here you can see now we have the expanded ad type. We have our final URL. This is in a different position than it was in the other ad, but it's still the same thing. The final URL is where the ad is going to finally end up. The title is Reading Solid Code in this case, and here we have a second title. So I've just put my name there kind of arbitrarily. The path, this is a new feature in Expanded Ads. I'm not going to use that, but you can go ahead and click on this question mark icon and learn more about that. This is just a visual display element. And then the ad text is exactly the same as in the previous video. Mobile URL, we left blank there. And then to set up the tracking, this is exactly the same. You simply click on the Add URL options. None of this section has changed in any way. You simply put down your tracking link here. If you want to put any sub IDs, you put them right on the end, just as I showed in the previous video. You can leave the rest of the custom parameters blank. You save right here. And that's all you need to do. There are two things I've seen people getting confused by. One is they're going into their campaign and they're trying to set their campaign wide tracking template because that's actually what Bing suggests that you do. But Bing uses a different model to track and their model is not compatible with ClickMagic's model. So you can't use the campaign wide tracking template. You have to use the tracking template associated with each ad. So the first thing you want to do is go into the ad and set the tracking link there. The second thing I want to point out is if your ad is rejected, don't immediately assume that it's ClickMagic. We have thousands of people using ClickMagic with Bing, and I can assure you that ClickMagic is not the reason your ad is being rejected. The way to determine this is to simply get your ad approved first before you ever try to set up tracking. Just get your ad set up first, wait until it becomes eligible, and then go in and add your tracking link. Resubmit your ad and you'll see that it takes it just fine. So hopefully this quick overview of Bing's new expanded ads will allow you to use that new feature of Bing with ClickMagic. This is Steve with ClickMagic. If you have any questions, just contact us at our help desk. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.